What is going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment. And we are here back at the farmlands here in Wreckfest yet again on this fabulous Friday. And uh, we are here for stage three of the farmlands because stage one and two have been spectacular. And if you haven't seen those, you absolutely need to go watch them because they have been unbelievable up until this point. So uh, we're here for stage three, going right in line and order. And uh, I was asked to use the Lightning McQueen car again by some of the comments since I used the King in the first one. I figured I'd bust it out for this one as well. So that's the car choice for today. And we got Santa Claus right in front of us yet again. So that'll be interesting. We'll have to see if we take him out right off the bat like we did in the first one. And uh, we'll see how stage three goes here. So we'll go ahead and jump right into this first one. And we're starting about mid-pack, so this will be interesting. And we're off and underway here. See if I can get to the middle of Santa Claus and make this sharp turn right off the bat, and it's a pileup already. It's already a big one, and we got one going over. Well, that did not take long, and this is an interesting part of the track that I don't know if we've even been on before. So, stage three. Let's see if we can power and buy a couple of these guys. We got them bouncing off the walls, T boning them. Oh, head on hit right there with Morgan Shepard. Get the roller skates. Oh, I don't know who that was that just got us, but they got us good, and they're going to keep getting us good. Oh, we can recover it. Got back on the wheels, luckily. Was that Jimmy Johnson again in that that wagon? Every time. Oh, my goodness. We got a miss in the corner. I missed the corner. Oh, and then I'm going to get ass packed into another dimension. Oh, my God. And it happens again. I think I lost a wheel and all that. Well, we did have a rule about wheelless attempts here. And, in fact, I can't even drive right now. Let's see if I can reset. But my god, look at the car. We've done what? Four corners? Three or four corners? And we've been killed. Let's see if I can... Oh, wait a minute. Hey, hey, check. Get your hay here. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Mark Martin, Bill Elliott up here. Hey, Billy Elliott's in a different car this time. Maybe he won't cause a bunch of big ones like he did in stage two. Oh, we're going off the track. We're going up and over. <laughs> going straight over. Digging in. Hate to see it. Oh, I guess I might as well, since it's the first attempt, I might as well just continue on at this rate, right? Tony Stewart's gonna just blow by me. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, this car is really struggling. Really, really struggling. Oh, Ernie Irvin swerving. Where are you doing? Oh, oh, wow, and that kills us. That takes us out of the race. Swerving Irvin puts me to death. Straight into the wall and lost two tires, and that is an auto death. So there you go. We finished 20th. We did manage to finish in front of a champion, at least, in Dale Jarrett. So we got that going. Well, all right. That was attempt number one. We didn't even get to the finish line. All right. Well, we got to try that out again. Try to get that win. Let's see if we can get this win right here. I got to remember that there's a corner right here and try and slide things up the inside of Santa Claus. Excuse me, I'm getting on the naughty list this year for that for that <laughs> remark right there. Oh, man, we're getting caught out. Somebody's going for a bail roll back there. It was Dale Jarrett again. Oh, we're swerving out here. We're good, though. We're good. Got Mark Donahue, the legend, in front of me. I mean, who, uh, who in this game isn't a legend in this mod? Oh, yep. Nope. Thought, oh, and Jimmy Johnson for the second race in a row is going to just clean me out. I'm going to get T-Mode hard here, aren't I? Yes, I am. Was a little bit behind the door, luckily, but a hard hit nonetheless, and I might have just beached the car, and indeed I did. So that's going to be a reset, and then I almost drive it right back off course again. All right, we got a corner right here. Let's see if we can take that nice and easy, or, or, or not, or not at all. Oh my god, <laughs> what are you people doing? You guys are dumb. These drivers, man, 4 IQ, who needs brakes when you just got the car in front of you, I guess. I don't I don't understand that mentality, but we get by a couple of them there. We spun out, look like Matt Kenseth, maybe. Oh, we got more of them getting into trouble up here in the hay. Look at this. Oh, oh, no. Oh, bad accident right there for Donnie Allison. Flipping it over. We got one going off track up here and straight into the wall. That's Dale Jr. Watch your head, bud. All right, let's go fly down here. Oh, we're, I think we're at the site of the last death right here. We're going to go and fly right by all oh, the car. Turns so much better when you actually got all four wheels on the car, eh? Let's see if we can get through. Oh, that's a tight corner. Oh, my God. What kind of corner design is that? That's like one of those rally hairpins right there. Oh, and then nobody's making the corner. Wow. All right. Well, hey, at least we got back on track there. Might have gave a little kiss to that telephone pole back there. But we're good. Let's see. 
Can we get back through here? We're gonna hit the safe spot in the walls, the guy in front of us. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, just gonna squeak by. Who's that, Greg Sachs? Hitting a parked car right there. We're up into fourth, boys. This is going pretty well, dare I say. Oh, we got a big collision up here in front of us. Earl Ross is gonna take the win. Oh, man, I'm gonna just grab somebody on the way by. Can I get to Mark Donahue before the finish line? I think the finish line is right here. Mark Donahue, oh, it's gonna be a photo finish, but I think Mark Donahue's just gonna finish. No, it's so close. Second place! Oh, we robbed Mark Donahue right at the end. Look at the margin. Oh my, let's go see it. <whistles> Pretty close right there. Pretty close indeed. Well, that was a spectacular race for second place. Just fell a little bit short there. But man, oh man, Earl Ross gets the win out from underneath us. Because of course he does. But we're going to go ahead and do this one again and we're still going for that win. So this appears to be a much shorter track than some of the other ones, but provides just as much a carnage as you can see right in the first corner. Not even a way to avoid the pileup. Just gotta ride into it and hope for the best, I guess. I don't know, we're gonna keep going here though. We're gonna get this thing spun around. Not before Tony Stewart tries to commit murder on us. Uh, we, got a, we got a nice little tat, tat from behind by Bobby Hillen Jr., also known as Santa Claus, it looks like. So that's an interesting... Interesting combination right there. Watch out. Oh, we're going over, boys. We're going over. Uh-oh, that's a bad spot to be rested in. Oh, thanks, guys. Appreciate the help right there. Knocked me back on my wheels. Good stuff. All right. Lucky I didn't get stuck right there in the side of this road. Oh, we got them hairpin coming up. Watch out. Oh, or just dump me. Dick Brooks, my old buddy. Just going to turn me around. Look at that pile up back there. Those fans are in a, couldn't be in a worse spot, dude. They could not be in a worse spot. You want to be on the inside of that corner, not the outside. You're going to get killed on the outside. And speaking of getting killed, there goes somebody going on a wild barrel roll. Is that Dick Trickle? I couldn't even see the name. It looked like Dick Trickle. It might not have been, though. Who knows? What a wild ride, though. We got one going off track here in front of us. I'm about to get passed over here by Bill Elliott, my buddy from stage two of this event at the Farmlands. Oh, it's not one to turn too great. We're going to follow Ray Elder right into the wall, and I think that's going to result in a wheel loss for us again. And Ray Elder's just going to put me back in the wall. Okay, buddy, I see how it is, and we're stuck on the side of the road here. Oh, Ray Elder just got taken out. I got to take down assist for that. I am definitely going to be triggered now. Oh, man, forget about turning this thing. Can I get it reset back in the right direction? I do. Lucky break there. All right, I don't. I think our shot to win is gone with three wheels on this thing. Since we're already pretty close to home, though, and this thing is a fairly short race. Oh, there's no way. There's no way this thing's gonna turn. We're just gonna have to ride that wall. Just gonna ride that wall. There we go. All right, we got a nice little straightaway right here. We'll have to ease it into the corner. I don't know what we're gonna do up here. It's gonna be another wild bouncing corner. Donnie Allison gets the win, and he had a hellacious crash just a few attempts ago. I'm really having to slow this thing down and steer it with the throttle. And now we can power it down to the finish line. I'm about to get... Somebody about to pull the same move I did on Don... Oh, no, I got dumped at the line by who? Who wrecked me right at the line? At least when I passed Donahue, I got by him. Was it Fireball Roberts? Fireball! I see you out here, Fireball. Killing me out here. All right, well, geez, man. We, we finished seventh that time. We did worse than we did. But, uh... Still going for that win, so we're not done yet. All right, going in for the next attempt, and we got to watch out for this just straight-up right-angled corner right here, and we are going to try and turn into this thing nice and early, get knocked up on two wheels, knocked around, and spun out. Thank you, Jimmy Johnson, for showing some patience right there and preventing that accident. Oh, wait! That's not what happened at all, and I'm going to beat it on the outside of the track, so we're just going to go ahead and reset. We got somebody, Bill Elliott, who's doing pirouettes over here. Still at the start. All right, all right. We gotta get, we gotta get moving now. We're down in 18th. We gotta get some. Oh, bad, bad blind corner to be stopped in there. Whoever that was, I can't believe we made it out of there alive. That could have gone so much worse. Here we got the hairpin. One of the hairpins. The first one is not a hairpin, but the nice angled corner right there. One of those cars just turned into a straight up roll cage. Okay, seems legit. We'll continue on there. That's how you go from, like, 14th to 8th and one straightaway in corner here. And this is just a madhouse. I'm going to dump Morgan Shepard head on the wall. Don't forget the roller skates, bud. All right. Hey, we're sitting in third right now. This is looking pretty good. But we've got one in front of us. I don't even see the... Okay, there they both are. 
the hill was just hiding one of them right there. Let's see, get out of the corner without hitting that wall. We do. The guy in front of us does not. Dale Earnhardt. Come on, Dale. I told you you quit doing that Danica Patrick impression yesterday, and then I go ahead and just fly through the corner. All right, well, hey, we'll just go ahead and do that corner the other way. <laughs> that you can do it. All right, and we're going to keep on going into second now. Donnie Allison right back in the lead. Come on, we got some good power in this car. Lightning McQueen is hauling today. He's got a big old engine underneath that hood. Oh, put it in hard in the wall, though. And we're going to try and power down here. We just need to floor it. Donnie, I need him to make a mistake, I think, at this point. Because he is got a massive lead. Is he going to put it in the wall? Hard in the wall. Wrecks it. Big time. We're going to squeak by right at the end. And we're going to conquer stage three just like that. How about it? That was awesome. Right there. I am really loving stage three. It was a little short. A little sweet, but we got it right there. And Donnie Allison absolutely destroyed himself in that last corner and threw away the win. Gift wrapped it to us. We walked away with it. So there you go. That's how you do it. We're not done, though. We got that win, but we're not done. Because we need to get the NASCAR legends on this track and see how they do. Let's go do it. All right. We are back here at the Farmlands in Stage 3 with the NASCAR Legends cars this time around. And we have got the gray ghost here as well. That is going to be an awesome car to run with. I love the chrome on it. That is pretty sweet looking. And we're starting to another pretty sweet looking ride over there. The 12 car is pretty nice looking as well. So let's see how we fare. We're starting just about the same spot as we did last time. So this will be interesting to see how the NASCAR legends do here on the farmlands of stage three. Let's see. Can we get to the first corner? Not even close. It's a parking lot, boys. Oh, and I'm going up and over. It is a massive parking lot. We didn't even make it to the first corner. Oh, my word. What a sight to behold right there. We got the fire truck. We're going to need it back there. Oh, watch out. We got a clog track up here now. What are you doing? Oh, my goodness. Texas Terry took his life in his own hands. Backed right into traffic. What a legend of men. And we got who is that behind us? Bobby LeBron. Oh, yep. Yup, that just happened. That totally just happened. Oh my god, what a brutal impact that was caused entirely by myself. Let's see, can I even drive this thing still? Oh, we got a shot here, boys. Hang on, if we're in it, we can win it. Let's go. We got it. We're not going to talk about what happened back there. I don't want to see a single comment about what just happened. Just go ahead and pretend it never existed. Hey, watch out. Oh, hey, check. Get your hay here and get killed while you're at it. Oh, one health the dream. One health the dream, ladies and gentlemen. Can it be done? Can it be done? Oh, it's going to die right here, isn't it? No, it's not. Is somebody going to come along and kill me? No, they're not. All right. Let's just watch it. Oh, it's not. It's really not wanting to turn right now. It's really not. Oh, please don't hit me. Please don't hit me, Donnie. Oh, thank you. Oh, digging in. Got to reset again. Morgan Shepard almost eats my lunch. Kirk Bush. Luckily, I'm still a ghost. The gray ghost. Let's see here. Oh, Jeff Gordon in the 28 for some reason is going to be giving me a scare as well. There's no way I'm going to make it to this corner. There's absolutely no freaking way at all. Move. Please move. Please move, people. How am I going to do it? How is he going to do it? If I finish this, this is a miracle. If I finish it. Then we're throwing a party or something. We're, we're throwing. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, there it is. I tried to hit the brakes. All I did was lock up. And then steering is obviously a no-go. So the hairpin catches me lacking yet again. No way are the NASCAR legends doing very They're just doing awful at this track. But maybe that was just a, a freak bad start. Let's go try it again. All right, we're going back. Under green once again here for our next attempt with the NASCAR Legends, and they are not driving like Legends, they're driving like Wookiees. But we're gonna get through there that first corner. Oh, not quite, not quite. Kurt Busch had other plans, and here we go. Here it goes right here. This could kill us. It does kill us, and there you go. That is gonna do it for the Craig Ghost. Made it one corner and half a straightaway, or a quarter of a straightaway, maybe and met our death and demise we might even finish last because of that we did finish dead last what a disgusting act by kurt bush i see you back there kurt bush you better not be eyeballing me can't believe what he did to me dump me 
Okay, let's see. Oh boy. Yep. Yep. Parking lot. Parking lot. Not even close. Let's see. Can I back this thing up here? We want to find a reverse gear car. Can we do that, please? Thank you. Finally, get out of there. Could have just spammed the reset button, but we got to keep things a little bit legit, right? Or at least attempt to. Got Ron Bouchard up here in front of us. Let's see if we can make some passes. This car, oh, the steering is hurt. The steering is already hurt. It does not want to turn. And that, that dent in the hood is probably what's causing it. Oh, lock, lock. Oh, God. There we go. Somebody's going to come through this and kill. They're, they're going to kill themselves or they can kill me. One of the two. That is a mother of all pileups right there. Oh, and somebody's piling into it. I just saw Kyle Busch come flying up in the air. I was laughing at it so hard. I drew all off the track. All right, can we get by the hay without incident? We can, it looks like. All right, all right, all right. We kind of have to... Again, I'm steering with the gas now. Because uh, th this steering is really, really struggling. See, we're in eighth right now. Bobby Allison up there is in the lead and losing time. So we must have wadded it up around here somewhere. We got one in front of us putting it in the wall. And he's stuck. Who is that? Morgan Shepard, get the roller skates, bud. You'd have better luck on the roller skates out here. All right, this is the hairpin. I finally started to learn. Learn my lesson around here. Oh, oh, Chad, you hate to see it. All right, let's see if we can get some power down the straightaway here. Up the hill. Let's go for We got Jeff Gordon in front of us. Tony Stewart now in the lead. This is a blind corner, really, and a kind of a deceptive one as well. The car is really tight, not one to turn. There we go. We didn't hit the wall. At least we got that going for us. Come on. Can we sneak a top 10 before this is over? We got the car stalled up here in front of us. We just might. Oh, we got them piling up here in front of us. Let's get on those brakes nice and early here. We're going to pass like four of them right here. Tony Stewart's going to get the win, and we're going to go all the way to second in the final corner. Oh, no. Watch out for the fans. I'm coming right for the fans. Oh, God. Thank for that barrier. All right. Well, hey, second place is not bad, but it's not the win we're going for. Tony Stewart, the man himself, the living legend, gets the win. Good for him. And uh, again, we're going to have to go back and try it out and get that win. I got to say, though, these have been spectacular races thus far. I really haven't had one that was boring. These have all been exciting races. Albeit maybe a little bit chaotic and crazy and parking lot filled. Oh, as I am packing everybody from behind. But we got them. Oh, man, they're just stuffing each other in the wall. We're up to seventh here, and we're going to try and steal a few more spots up the inside if I can help it. Excuse me, Donnie. Excuse me, Donnie. Excuse me, Morgan. Oh, they're going to go back by me on the inside then. Okay, all right. Why am I stuck in the wall? Oh, ass packed right there. Couldn't even see who it was with a fireball. Oh, here we go again. Here it goes again, and this is going to be a bad one. That is going to be an awful wreck. There's just no chance of me making that corner ever, is there? And they're piling in. Look at them piling in over here. Oh, I wish I could get rid of the scoreboard right now so we could just watch them dying. Because they are literally piling in. I, I wish I could see it. Oh, it kills me. No, there's no way to get rid of it. Oh, that sucks. Anyway. All right, well, that was. Uh, we're going to go ahead and pretend that didn't happen either. We're going to go start our next one up. What a pileup. I literally think that every single car that was behind us ended up piling up into that pile back there. That was outstanding. I'm going to pull off to the side here and try and see if they'll make the parking lot without me here as I immediately get it stuck on the side of the course. And indeed, they did pile it up, and then I pile into the pile. Oh, and now we're, now we're parking lot. Thank you, Swervin. Thank you for that. All right, well, we're just going to go through a couple of them, all right? And that's how you get to fourth, ladies and gentlemen, right there. The bad news is I just saw a car way off in the distance up ahead of us, so we are now millions of miles behind everybody that we need to beat. So we're going to have to hope for some accidents here and hope for that nobody from behind us just comes through and destroys me, and here we go. Here we go. Oh, my God. I turn in early, I die. I don't turn at all, I die. I just suck. This is garbage by me. Let's see, can I get this thing on with one wheel? Probably not. We, we've tried it before. Have we not? I guess that was with a regular car. The NASCAR Legends, very different beast. I'm in second. How am I in second? Why am I in second? Who allows this to happen? And we're going for the hay barrels, boys. The hay barrels, I did it again. Oh, no. Here come the comments. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't mind me. Just can't steer over here. Just have a real hard time doing anything a race car likes to do. Yep. Yep. Come on. Put that power down, boy. Let's go. 
Oh, it just does not want to turn. It just does not want to turn. Kyle Busch's car is going to come by and almost cream me. That was Dick Brooks in that car, of course. So it would have been fitting if he had actually killed me, but he didn't do it. Oh, and we're going off course. Oh, we're stuck. No, come on. Power out of it. Oh, what a save. All right. We saved us a restart there. Or not a restart, but a reset. Oh, this might this might end in one, though. Using that throttle to steer. Oh, don't you knock me. I don't need any help. That's not the kind of help I need, anyway. Come on, let's see if we can get it back on track. I am bleeding spots right now. This is a hairpin coming up, too. This is going to be rather interesting, considering my car doesn't even want to turn a little bit, let alone a hairpin corner. Oh, what is this design? I love it, but it's just, it does not, it does not compute with these cars. I'm having to back it up to get it through, and I think I just beached myself. I indeed did, so that'll, that'll do it for that. Oh, and we're going off track right away. Let's see if I can keep it straight, in a straight line here. Dick Trickle, the White Knight himself, gets the win. One of the most legendary short track racers of all time. Gets a farmland sprint race win. What a beast. Gotta love the late, great Dick Trickle. Let's see if we can just ride it around the wall here and try to get this thing back home. This is just a, an abandoned run, basically, at this point. But I want to try and get it back home to the finish line because this, this has been an up and down race if I've ever seen one. We're just gonna bounce it off the wall to get it to turn. And in fact, that actually worked quite well. Oh, Bobby Allison's gonna go by me on the outside there. Just at the end, Tiny Lund's gonna give me a shot too. Not if I can say anything about it. We're gonna flip across the finish line. Oh my God, we just had a massive flip across the finish line to finish in the top five. How about that? It's no more epic than that. We gotta try it again and get this win finally. When is it gonna come? Well, off we go again. Once again, I'm gonna try it again as well. This is a stupid idea, but I don't care. Cars are not allowed to reset at the start of the bit. Well, I just hit the reset button, so I don't care because there's no way I'm getting back off the grass after that excursion. All right, let's see. We didn't get caught in the pileup this time, so that's good, although there didn't appear to be that big of a pileup as there was last time, so that's a rather interesting note here is I'm gonna give a shot to Swervin and Swervin's gonna go head onto the wall and he's probably gonna come back up and give me a slap here unless I crowd him down and I do and I block him there you go and now we're sitting in Dick Brooks's draft here we're gonna try to make the corner and there's absolutely no way that was ever gonna work oh that is a problem and the wheel is bad the engine has failed but we're still driving it somehow we're up in a second and Ron Bouchard is just ahead of us in the lead could this be it Will I ever make that corner back there? We may never find out because this could be it if we get through the rest of this race clean and can catch Ron Bouchard. If he makes a mistake, then I think we're home free, but we gotta see what he can do. Will Ron Bouchard go re into one of these corners and give this, ri give this race gift wrapped to me? He's gonna hit the wall right here, is he? Oh no, he saves it. It looked like he was getting sideways. I'm gonna hit the wall. Just scraped off of it a little bit there. All right, here we comes the hairpin. Here comes the hairpin. Some nice braking right here by me, myself, and I. Let's see. This is a little bit of a detour right here, but back on the racetrack we go in the lead, and Ron Bouchard and I have exchanged roles. Can we get it to the end? Come on. We got to do it. We got to do it. Oh, my. A race filled with drama, spectacular wrecks, pile up, parking lot crashes, and Ron Bouchard giving me the business here at the end of this one and he is gonna have one final say it looks like maybe in the final corner unless we can put the power down and keep it in front of him we're gonna put it in the wall are we know we're gonna just keep it over there Ron Bouchard is closing though can we get it to the line watch out for the fans get out of the way we're gonna get the win and Ron Bouchard is gonna pile into us afterwards and give us a nice little ass packing to call it a day there you have it ladies and gentlemen that is how you win at the farmlands in stage three. Three stages down, two stages to go. What a blast this has been. This farmlands map has proven proven to been proven to be. Man, I can't even speak. I'm so excited about how well this has gone. That this farmlands map is is becoming one of my favorite maps to run in. And I'm looking forward to stage four and five. I hope you guys are too. If you are, be sure to hit that like button, comment down below. Let me know you want to see it. Because that's how I know. We'll go ahead and run into those as soon as we can. Because those you know are going to be great. Man, this has been awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, if you do, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe. As always, all that stuff helps me out. And I really greatly appreciate it. 
And that'll pretty much do it. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace!